Oh, so the, the Office of One has got a lot of hype coming into this season. Um, for obvious reasons, a lot of guys buying a lot of experience. Where can this Office of One kind of improve and make that next step? Uh, obviously, we had a big loss in right guard from Landon, so uh, a few guys are fighting for the spot. Uh, so there's always improvement that can be done there. Um, uh, improvement as a whole, you know, you can always get better. Uh, we had. I want to say 12 sacks, or maybe give or take, um, last year, and we want to cut those down. And uh, you know, we, there's a lot of things we like to do um, as a as a unit as a whole. So we're just kind of working to get better. I know coming out of spring, it looked like Pronto was going to slide into the right guard spot. With him getting hurt now for the season, right before training camp starts, does that throw you guys for you know, off track a little bit? I mean, it's definitely a tough loss. You know, uh, John is experienced and uh, he has, he's played games. You know, so it's it's a big loss for us. Um, but we, we, you know, as we had confidence in him, we have confidence in the guys that backed him up at the time. So, you know, uh, Brad Henson, he's played a lot of games, so uh, we have a lot of comfort in him. Uh, uh, RJ Prince is, is learning right guard a little bit, and he's played in a few games, and so he has game experience. Uh, Tommy Hatton's looking at right guard, playing some. So uh, we have we have uh, faith in all those guys that they can get the job done. So you know it will be all right. What's been the focus for you this all season? Uh, a few different things. Uh, you know, just kind of working on technique a little bit. Uh, usual, just watching film and studying you know different things that flaws and stuff I found last year and. Uh, just trying to make it work it out. Is there an adjustment period switching to Mitch? Or he took so many snaps from you guys last year, I assume. Yeah, I mean, there's not much of a transition. I mean, last year when they would rotate and stuff like that, we never really noticed, you know. Uh, they were both good. We both had, we had faith in both of them. And, uh, you know, we're excited to see what Mitch is going to do this year. I know he's excited. Uh, so, not a big transition. By and large, as a group, you guys have grown up together. Uh, how much, how huge is that chemistry for you, especially when you think now as opposed to two years ago? Uh, really big. You know, we're all excited because we've, uh, you know, we're all, our class is really tight. Um, we're Fedora's first, you know, real class. Uh, so, you know, we're excited that we're all, like, seniors and, and redshirt juniors so we're excited all of us have been playing for a while and uh, we're you know we're excited to get out there and, and uh, see what we do. With the responsibilities you have with having to make a lot of calls and stuff like that is it easier because those guys are there and you guys kind of yeah, the, yeah. The knowledge and experience is at a greater level? Yeah definitely because they can help me out whenever I'm trying to figure out other stuff and uh, when I'm trying to make calls they get, they're making calls and if we're in Indy uh, you know hurry up tempo offense that we run uh, you know, Caleb and, and Brad and, and, and John, they all make calls for us. So everybody makes each other's jobs easier.